off the bat guys, I have here a M5, which we were just doing a car wash and basic detail to this morning, uh, but I figured I was going to give a try to another detail spray, since I buy these left and right. This one is Ride Shine from Shine Supply, so this is a already pre-diluted gallon of product, which is like 32 bucks on Shine Supply's website, uh, so I have it in a 32 ounce spray bottle. So. We're going to use this as our final wipe on this to give it some gloss and slickness uh, and make sure there's no streaks left over from our car wash. So, as always, the right way to do things is to spray your towel first. So I'm going to use one of my awesome Fine Lab drying towels and I'm going to saturate it nice and good to show you the right way and then I'm going to do it the same way. Slick, considering that it needs the uh, clay off really bad, and uh, the mother one. So, now that we did things the right way, I'm going to do it my way, which is the faster way. Spray direct. Now, normally you shouldn't do this because you can get overspray places, or you might have too much product, uh, but I think I've washed enough cars over the last six years uh, to be able to tell uh, how much detail spray you should spray onto a panel first. So that went on pretty easy and the surface feels pretty slick. So now I'm gonna go around and do the rest of the car and then I will park it in the sun and do a little after video momentarily. All right, so here is the final result. Now this thing is all washed, uh, covered in ride shine. Got the tires dressed uh, with another shine supply product. Say it looks pretty good for a detail spray so we can add that to my list of things I approve of so if you want to grab a shine supply ride shine go on shinesupply.com and then also make sure you subscribe to my channel so you can catch more awesome reviews and detailing how to's and tips and tricks uh, and then we will see you next time thank you for watching